Hi everyone, welcome to another episode of Both Barrels. My name's Vern, this is my father Curtis, and today we're talking about Dickel's White Whiskey. I've been wanting to do it on the show with the boys, but they keep saying, nah, 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 we'll do that later, we'll do that later. And I got it about almost two months ago, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, quite a while ago. I think we got this while we were getting the Van Winkle, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's been a while ago. And we got it at Van's Liquor, I'm pretty sure. Yes, we did. And um, again, Van always has that wonderful stuff that we can't necessarily get in other places. Yeah, they're good people. Check them out. Yeah. And so we got this wonderful Dickles White Label. One. Dickles One. And, you know, I've never had it. But I really like Dickles a lot. I'm wondering if it's going to be sort of like a moonshine where there's not going to be a lot of finish on it. It's 91 proof. Hmm. Let's give it a shot and see. What does it say? Yeah. Well, I, I'm trying to see if maybe this is uh, this is what it's just Dickles that hasn't been put in the barrel is like. I'm wondering if it's like if it's like a white dog. Is uh, is normal Dickles made of corn typically, uh, I, or well, is it I a mean, blend of stuff? Well, I, I believe it's a mash, mm -hmm. and I believe there's other things in it. Yep, so to the nose, you just get the burn of alcohol, basically. It's very clean. Wow, it's really clean. It's just simply direct and that's alcohol. I mean, that's bordering on what you would think a vodka would be. Really? It's, yeah, that's super, super clean. That's ridiculously clean. It is. It's amazingly clean. It's one of the cleanest sort of white dog uh, moonshines I've ever had. But it is smooth. And incredibly smooth. Yeah. For for 91 proof, it's really, really, really smooth. Yeah, typically with Dickles, I associate like getting punched in the face, you know. It's not a bad whiskey, but it's not necessarily as smooth as some other stuff. It's very intense and in your face. And that's one of the things I really like about it is that it is so intense. The rye is like, wow, I just drank rye. Definitely. You know, and they're 12, it's just like, oh, I I just drank whiskey. I mean, I know that's whiskey. Yeah. There's no question about it. There must be something else that they're doing, like with, the, with their barrel aging or their mashing process that makes their whiskey as intense and powerful as it is, because this, um, I wouldn't know that this is from Dickles, frankly. Cause really? It's, it's just it's, it's just so it's clean. clean. There's none of that hairspray that you get from some cheap vodkas. I really wish I would have bought another bottle of this while we were there. There wasn't many there. Mm. I should have picked another one up. Maybe he'll get more in. I hope. Do you know if this is available in Iowa, or do you think it's something that's pretty I allocated? have not seen it in Iowa at all. I haven't seen it allocated or anything. Maybe that will change, but right now, I've only seen it outside of Iowa. Thank you, Jeff, over at Vans. Yes. This has been a wonderful bottle to try. Yeah, definitely. We should uh, maybe give him another call tomorrow and see if he has any left or is planning on getting more in. Jeff, thank you. Thank you, Jeff. We thank appreciate you. it greatly. The Whiskey Tears appreciate you. Both Barrels appreciates you as well. Uh, anything else you would like to add? Nope. All right. Well, as always, thank you for watching, everyone. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe for more content, leave a comment if you have any questions, we'll try to answer it as best we can, and as always, thank you for watching, we'll catch you next time.